not aware of these two, uh, by the way, welcome to House of 3000. Uh, glad you could tune into the stream, because if you do, you know that these guys are New York staples. Gatsby, mm -hmm. newly minted onto the New York PR, I believe. Yes, yeah. finally in New York PR. I've been waiting He's forever. He's been so close for so many seasons. I know. And, you know, now that he has been officially inaugurated, why not celebrate that by taking out another player who has been on New York's PR for, like, over half a decade like, now? Ever. Forever, yeah. ever, and ever. Mr. John Numbers himself repping the green we fit. Um, no punish off of the free fall uh, uppy. It's so hard to get oh. numbers. I love that. He specifically nice. got the sour spot on that. Beautiful. And look at that. Beautiful. There are so many players out there where I would say, don't do it. Don't go off stage against numbers. It's what he wants. But Gatsby, it's fine. He's doing what he needs to. He is reading those options. He oh. is making numbers pay. No. Why? Gatsby. Yes. No, he worked. Oh, both of them. He had oh, to fade goodness. back because of that uppy. And that's actually going to be two stocks to one. I what is the start to this game? This is the quick, but we're, we're talking about We Fit and Falcon. We're having a really fast paced game today. Of course, Falcon being the faster of the two, um, pacing wise, and We Fit can always slow down as much as he can. I think that's what numbers going on for right now. Often go on the ledge, use some attention to his advantage, and also uh, pick it up with some aerials as well. Going for a, a very hard read down smash that doesn't really do anything for him. And Gatsby has a whole other stuff to play with, going opting over to go on the ledge once more and try to two frame uh, numbers as he recovers and put the pressure on him, honestly. Yeah, okay. Another thing is you've noticed, Numbers has never gotten deep breathing because Gatsby's just always mm -hmm. in his face. And that's something that Gatsby loves to do, using that up B on the ground. First of all, the hitbox for that thing is bigger than ridiculous. it looks. It's, it's ridiculous. ridiculous. And the way he drifts with it, I've seen him get punished for doing it maybe like four times in my life. But uh, there we were saying how, oh yeah, go. All right, oh, fine, it. game's love over, it. cool. Lily um, just drop down a smash, love it. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> You're invincible. What's the worst that could happen? Exactly. Because um, numbers is gonna be rushing up on you in order to secure some more damage, especially with maximum well, rage. Well, he was active. invincible. I don't know what numbers yeah, is doing. I, don't know what I think numbers was happens. like trying to run through him. Maybe. Like get to the other side of the stage. You know, because that's something people like to chase you down when they have mm -hmm. invincibility. Um, and so sometimes you could just do the, the 6 million IQ play of just running into them and they'll run right past you. Uh, but sometimes you have fighting Look against somebody with the 6 IQ play of just up smashing in place. This is a big IQ play. Actually yeah. manages to scare number out, numbers out enough with the threat of that uppy and numbers just couldn't come back and say quickly enough. 30% already? Hello? Yeah, that started off with that numbers landing a falling neutral air. I am shocked you only took 30. <laughs> You're absolutely right, because we already know the, the, the power of We Fit, but here we go. Power We Fit, numbers especially, is of course Ledge, is friend. That's the game that he's going to be going for today. Down, uh, down there on the stage right there, getting the sweet spot as well. And Gatsby has a lot catching up to do. You know, of course, Rage is building slowly with, with Falcon. Finally getting an yeah. opening with the double up oh. airs and trying to go for a knee, but fading back a little bit too far. Okay, going for that huge read. Ooh. But at the very least, even if Gatsby didn't necessarily get rewarded for, you know, numbers air dodging, oh my god, okay, uh, it conditions numbers to nice. not be, mm -hmm. oh my god, well he shouldn't be shielding when he's right in Gatsby's face. Yeah, so when Gatsby's doing rapid job all over again on your on shield, and then once you have that, that up the off shield, you're great. You have that stock taken care of. Of course, we have deep breathing active at the moment. Humongous damage oh. for, <gasps> okay. tried it, tried double dipping. I respect it, I truly do. All right, the back air is going to be taking it with deep breathing in effect that will absolutely be enough. And this is a two stocks for each player. That up tilt, it yeah, comes out so <laughs> fast, has like bizarre hitboxes that just beat out other hitboxes. And oh, you teched it place, you took so much damage for that. Oh man, that's, that's what I'm saying. Now that's, Gatsby, can, can he double dip it? Of course, we fit's recovery is very vertical. As you can see, John Numbers using his jump in order to come back on stage safely. I and he rolled out of that corner because of the uppies that Gatsby had been throwing out earlier. He's so good at not only, you know, punishing people, but then knowing what the counterplay is and starting to punish them for that. And that's something he's done how many times now? That deep offstage back air and numbers for what's normally headering. Very few. Oh, yo, what was that wave land? Oh my god. Yeah. Oh no, that, that was, yeah, that, that's the dare I was looking for for numbers. Numbers is not afraid to contest you off the stage with dare, but of course, Falcon has his own that's so hard to contest, contest with as well. But here we go. We're almost, we're literally at an even game all of a sudden. You know, num uh, that lead that Gatsby had is now suddenly gone, and Numbers trying to finish it off so quickly with the dare off stage, and both characters really skirmishing for their opportunity to open and close this game within the next 30 seconds. Oh, that should be a really big opening. Honestly, we yeah, have this huge double up air. No. Okay, 
neutral there. He's just barely, like, Numbers is going for these burst options, and Gatsby is just fading back enough. Nice. The down smash is nowhere near enough to actually get a kill right there. But this is deep, big, deep breathing. <gasps> Yo, you just Are need you the sun! You need the sun! <laughs> And All there right. it is, unfortunately. There is, of course, that Nair. Oh, I'm sorry, that Nair. Yeah, and that was really good. He finally waited for Gatsby to burn his jump. First of all, that's so funny, just kneeing the sun. It's just, but it, it put him in so much... Um, vitamin D. Hit more lag. like vitamin knee. It put him in so much hit lag because, of course, yeah. that move is just is just, is staying out for way longer than expected. And Numbers just is ran up while in the middle of and like yeah. of the animation, and got the punish yeah. that he was looking for. It was for. very cool, but also it, it was, was cool. kind of also got him killed. Yeah, it literally forward throw, yeah. sun, then he sun out, and then jumped, and there you go, pop. And that fingers. was actually really good. If you notice, Numbers charged that sun. That's why he jumped. It's because the sun was going. To, he was threatening with the sun to uh, hit him if he didn't jump, but he was already two, one step ahead. All right, but now we're moving into game three. These guys are going back and forth. Oh, yeah, speaking back of forth. back and forth. Back and forth in the air. You're absolutely right. But here you go, Gatsby with the ledge advantage uh, against Numbers. And of course, Gatsby, as we saw earlier, is not afraid to contest Numbers off ledge. And unfortunately, you can't go crossing up on Numbers like that. Even in the air, that back air is faint. Oh, and that oh, tech goes crazy! Yo, this is why he chose this stage. That side is just so cool. Oh. It works so well for Captain Falcon. And you know what? It keeps we fit in vertical while she's recovering. Nice. So deep. I... Yeah, no numbers. Before, he was bang, really just being super duper patient off stage, mm -hmm. being extra slow. And that's why that first time that Gatsby tried to go off there, he kind of got it turned around on him. Yo, hold on a second. Another you know tech... Yo, the up air! Oh my goodness. That, he wall jumped and got the back hit of up air and combo it into up B. I mean, so far this is still an even game, but the things mm -hmm. that Gatsby are, is doing, that's wholly it's, unique. It's the, it's the beauty of you know your counter -pick, picking to a stage that your character greatly benefits from. Of course, the, uh, the pillar stage of Kalos being so good for Falcons, um, for Falcon in general. Now here we go. Once again, Gatsby has to come up on air and going to the down air into back air. Once again, now on stage, into the platform, into the oh. air, contesting numbers as well. And there is another back air, but not taking it yet. Yeah, but he doesn't have okay. a jump. That should <laughs> do it. Wow, Gatsby right now with a solid, solid lead right here. <laughs> Uh, you know, I mentioned before how sometimes you just run at somebody when they're invincible and between yeah. the stock. That's Gatsby did that. That's what, that's what they both. They love doing it. They're, they're, it's, it's, it's a. I don't even know what's going on here. Another tech it's situation text. from the dare. This stage counter pick has already paid <laughs> an entire year's worth of dividends. It, it's paying rent right now. That's all I'm saying. Once again, charging Sun Cell, and of course, there's that header deep breathing active as well. Uh, but there's that need for that third game going towards Gatsby. Also, that's two times that Gatsby comes off the Halo platform, instantly gets the kill. Earlier, it was a bad smash there, yeah. just came down with first hit neutral air into knee. Uh, you numbers, have to. You're, you're invincible. It's free. You're invincible. It's that's, so free. I mean, if I have numbers, maybe just try and stay a little far away. That was the same thing he did last time. He ran to the middle of the stage. He I ran told you, the he keeps doing that. <laughs> yeah, you should probably... Maybe just stay on hold ledge. off on doing that. I don't know if staying on ledge is necessarily the right pick, although I do like the fact that numbers on, even though that was Gatsby's, you know, counter pick, obviously, yes. he was using those side platforms to hang on ledge more mm -hmm. because Falcon couldn't quite just, like, come in above for a down air. All right, and this is uh, usually numbers. It's his favorite stage, yes. or one of his favorite stages. Uh, and also, he picked one of his favorite tracks, so he's gotten the music power up. The he's music and Gatsby. stage power up. He, he should be should be all locked and loaded, even deep breathing active right off the bat. But, oh, nice little skirmish there, avoiding the dash attack from, uh, from Gatsby. And now Numbers is on ledge no with jump. the ledge advantage. Oh, but missing the grab, unfortunately. But there's a cross-up with the, with the frame six back air. Man, Numbers is in this corner, and Gatsby is... <gasps> so you just let that charge. Take him to the proc Oh, my goodness. <laughs> And the reason why, you know, Numbers' of stage, is, this is, this is Numbers' favorite stage, that little platform, you get, you have no area to really run away from We Fit. Oh. She can come at you quickly, and you have nowhere to go. This is Falcon, who has amazing air mobility, in order to get oh, to the stage. What was this? Okay, that's... Oh, but he dodges out of that knee, and look at this. What? You would not believe that Numbers was down a game going into this here. Beautiful. Nice, uh, nice using up smash to cast the roll in, and... Uh, coming right, just drifting into a low yeah. back air. 
so many of those. I, and I also want to point out that up smash that Gatsby got just before. Yes. One of the reasons why he got that is because he was off stage and Numbers panicked, was scared that uh, he was going to uh, get ledge trumped. And mm -hmm. you have to buffer an option at that point, and that's why he chose ledge troll. Okay, here we go. Now, once again, both characters opting to go off the off onto near the ledge um, of the stage. That upbeat grab coming in clutch, but unfortunately not taking against the stage. Humongous punish. No, free, fast falling out of no the jump. free fall. No jump. Ah, but grabs the ledge just a little bit too quickly. Numbers, though, getting so much damage, even if he's not getting a kill off stage. And ah, there's a kill in question. Yeah. yeah. What a quick... Wow, that game four was in, was gone in a flash. We we are speed running DTN today. That's what I'm thinking. Like we they want we want to get these best of fives out of the way. Yeah, no, if we're having a best of five, we want it to be a quick one. Yep. Um, but I think the one thing numbers fixed there, his off stage scrambles were so mm -hmm. much better. And mm -hmm. I mean, yes, not having that uh, Kalos side will help you, but just there were so many times where it felt like in games one and two, Gatsby would have gotten a quick reversal or yep. would have you know gotten a counter attack of some kind. Numbers didn't let that happen here, and now we're going to be moving on into, uh, it's going to be Town and Town City. City. Ooh, cute Interesting star. counter pick for, um, for Gatsby as, as Falcon, of course. Side Blast Zone's pretty, yep. uh, pretty close by. Definitely one of the reasons why he likes this stage is he can go deep, kill super early with back air, or things like their one into knee will kill mm -hmm. even earlier. So I definitely understand why he chose this stage. But also, there's more room on it, which means that Numbers might be able to run away, charge yeah. some suns that he maybe couldn't in those other stages. That's what I was going to say. You know, it gives uh, Numbers a lot of opportunity to just really just charge up suns out and, of course, uh, deep breathing whenever available. And there is, of course, lack of platforms gives Falcon no area to run towards. And Numbers, the, the skirmishes that he's kind of winning right now in the air, in the ground, and there's that first stop. And that was reminiscent of game two. He jumped towards Gatsby, Gatsby panicked and jumped himself, and that meant he burned that resource and the neutral, oh, sorry, the forward air was able to close out the stock. Lots of these Falcon kicks coming in and resulting in a lot of punishes for in, in favor of numbers. There's one more soccer ball coming out on the, on the, on the left most platform uh, on Town City and catching the jump in with the um, with up smash. Beautiful. Yeah, and that up smash covered quite a few options right mm -hmm. there. I definitely understand why Gatsby went for it, especially because I feel like Numbers hasn't been counterattacking from ledge nearly as much as we normally know him to do. You're completely right, and, uh, and of course Numbers opting to go for Epto off stage to cover a uh, jump in and roll option, but there it is. There's that second stock. Where did the stocks go? Where did these stocks go? We are once again here on. Uh, on okay. TNC, all three platforms available. Gatsby having to clean up this lead oh, okay. and might be able to no, just run up into knee. Beautiful. I was I was gonna say this was possibly Gatsby's winner stock right here. He is making his very last life count. He wants to stay in it. There, this is an even game. They've gone. I can't believe they've been going back and forth like this in this way, just beating each other up. <laughs> just. You're right. Merciless. It's 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 a it's a bloodbath over here on TNC. Whoa. Knee missing. Ah! It's making all the scream, and we're down here in the sun citation in order to avoid it. The uh, double up air coming in and connecting. Oh. It's the air skirmish once more. Going. No ledge jump, unfortunately. Still going Sus. deep off stage. The down B still to continue that combo. Numbers with no jump. I love that. Cancels it. Beautiful. Is that going to kill? Smash. It's, it's not. not. He gets to go all the way across the stage, and Numbers is alive. Deep breathing also on his body right now. He's looking for some type of big hit here. Clamps. He no not enough. Dash attack instead. We're going off in the air, and there's a going to do it? Yes, it, it does. Is. Wow. Game five, back and forth, to defend the North, ladies and gentlemen. God. Numbers was defending New York City for real in the skirmish. Did, oh my goodness, I, I'm flabbergasted. That down smash, that down smash looks like it was going to do it, but no, he survived mm -hmm. just barely. And you were saying about like the side blast zones, you know, being a little bit shorter on TNC, but unfortunately that didn't come in clutch for Gatsby. I think just because how far he was from and the side And numbers had helped out. I. Mm -hmm. With deep breathing, that's definitely, you know, that forward air had a lot of kick to it, but yeah, no, the amount of forward airs and kills that he air. got, yeah. Uh, four air just it just does so much for numbers, especially because it has two. Oh, more, oh many of Wii Fit's moves, of course, have double hitboxes, F2, um, down smash, forward air. It's, it's ridiculous, honestly. Header. Yeah, no, the Wii Fit has hitboxes in places that only a yoga instructor would have. I told you, you know what, it makes sense. At least it's okay she has it. You know, she's she's Wii Fit. She's a, she's a little instructor. You know, she got it. She got it. She's allowed to have this. And we're about to have our next match up right now. We have Sora.